Hi, this is a tutorial on how to rip video from a DVD using a PC computer, a Windows based computer. The first step is to download and install a program called Handbrake. It's a free program. If you Google Handbrake, you'll be able to pull up the appropriate um, page and download and install the appropriate program. Once you've downloaded and installed the program, launch the program. The next step is to insert the DVD into your machine that you'd like to pull video from. When we say rip video, that's what we mean by pulling video off of a DVD so you can, you can upload it to the web. So once the DVD is installed and you've downloaded and installed Handbrake, you're ready to get started. So in Handbrake, you come over here to Source in the top left hand corner and you click Source. And you'll see down here, you'll see that there'll, there'll be the video or the DVD that you've inputted. So I select that uh, DVD or that source. It'll take a few minutes usually to, to scan and, and kind of get ready and all queued up. And what this is telling me is you currently have automatically name output files enabled for destination file box. We do not have a valid directory. So this is pretty much is telling me that we need to tell uh, the computer where to save this file, which is easy enough. So you click OK. And the first step here is to select what you want to call the file and where you want to save it. So depending on how your DVD is burned, you may have more than one titles here. You may have one, two, three, or one, two. In this case, it's it's one big file. It's a 37 minute game, uh, so uh, you're okay here. But if you have multiple, you just repeat this steps for for each one of the different titles. But here we have one title, and we're gonna save this to the desktop and call it game. So, or you can save it anywhere on your computer where you're gonna find it. But I'll save it to the desktop and I'll call it game. Save. Now, next step is to come over here and click Web Optimized. So this will make it optimized for the web for uploading it to your profile. So click Web Optimized. And then you'll see a number of uh, tabs here. Click on the Video tab right here. And in the target size, we're going to input 600. So again, we've chosen where we're going to save the file and what we're going to call it. We've clicked on Web Optimized. We clicked on the Video tab and input a target size of 600. And we're going to click Start. Now you have to remember you're dealing with very big files here, so this isn't just going to happen right away. It's going to take usually an hour, hour and a half, two hours, depending on how long your, uh, how new your computer is, how fast your computer is. So just start the process and walk away. And you'll see down here you have a. Uh, percentage of, of, of where it is in the process so you can keep an eye on that but I, I the best idea is to kind of start this before you go to bed or you know before you, you have errands to run or other stuff to do but once the files uh, downloaded or done uh, ripped you'll be able to upload it right to your profile and please view the tutorial on how to upload video to see how to get this video up on your profile